I'm back to show you what I wear when I don't wear anything. If that makes sense. Um, I have six products in front of me and I'm going to be doing like an invisible, invisible makeup. Um, just what I'm going to be wearing today. I'm going to stay in. It's raining a lot and I think I'm going to play some Wii because that's like my new fetish. So um, let's just get started. Okay, so first off, I'm just going to use Painterly Paint Pot all over my lid. Um, yeah, just to even out my skin tone. Because, and as you all know, I do use my finger in this product. Um, just because I have a lot of, like, I don't know if you'd call it veining, but I have a lot of really visible veins on top of my um, eyelids. So I just remove that and make it all even looking can you see a difference <laughs> um yeah put some mascara on and I'm gonna be using Max X mascara because it's really really natural and I like to work with it it's really creamy somebody you asked me the other day like how I apply my mascara I don't know if you can see what I'm doing but I'm kind of um, turning the mascara on I put it on and then I kind of squeeze my eyes together so it kind of bends my lashes too or curl them, whatever you might want to call it. So even though it is like a really natural mascara, it still gives a lot to my eyes because my lashes are so light that you can't really see them. Just remember that it's really natural, so if you don't think like I'm putting enough on or whatever, I'm going for the natural look. So I'm just going to let that dry before I put something on underneath. Um, and then I'm going to put some brow set in my eyebrows. And this one is Girl Boy. Unfortunately, it's been discontinued because this color is like perfect for me. Um, but I've stopped up on it. This makes my uh, eyebrows a bit more red since this color in my hair right now is not really my natural color. Just makes everything look a bit more natural. You don't need to tell any, every, anybody that it's not natural, you know what I mean? I was just naturally born this beautiful. <laughs> that sounded so wrong, but yeah. You guys know my humor by now I think so let's see I love brow sets they're so easy to work with they look so good so that made everything a bit more red now didn't it and then I'm gonna be putting on some of the cream blend blushes um I'm only wearing foundation and concealer. I'm not wearing any powder. So, and this is just a, actually this is an all finger look. So if you don't have any brushes, you can just do what I do. I do have loads of brushes though, but I'm just, I like with creamy blushes, I like to blend it in with my fingers. And I'm listening to this song on repeat. Yes, I am. Because I think it's so cute. Because it's a movie about this guy who's obsessed with this girl. Oh. Anyway. So, natural rosy cheeks now. Very natural. And um, let's see. Ooh, that was my friend calling. 
in the middle of a tutorial. Oh my god, like bad timing. <sighs> so I think I'm gonna put a bit more of mascara on, just a tiny bit. I don't even know if you can see what I'm doing. And then a tiny bit underneath. There we go, and then I'm going to put a bit of uh, Pinkfish Tinted Lip Conditioner on. So if any guy was to see me right now, he wouldn't think I was wearing anything. But actually I'm wearing a ton of makeup. Just making it look all natural. Now I have a cream color base here in Luna, which is very white, but I think with my complexion it can look very natural. Just a tiny bit here. I think whenever I wear highlighter on my cheekbones, it takes off like 10 years. Well, maybe not 10 years, maybe five. I can't believe I'm turning 30 this year, huh? I don't have a crisis or anything about it. So that's the um, complete look. Let's see if I'll just go in so you guys can see it in the lighting here. Okay, this is horrible lighting actually. But um, this is my natural. I'm not wearing any makeup look. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.